back in 2013, Heroes the Game became the absolute best Bible trivia game out there. It generated more than 10 million minutes of interaction with the biblical narrative. Well, seven years later, here is the good news. Hope Channel is about to release Heroes 2. What imagery comes to your mind when you hear the word hero? Probably Superman or Spider-Man, right? Because of pop culture, we have linked the word hero to someone who can yield special powers. Here is what the dictionary says, however. Hero. A person who is admired for their courage, outstanding achievements, or noble qualities. Did you catch that? I'll read that again. Hero. A person who is admired for their courage, outstanding achievements, or noble qualities. It doesn't say anything about superpowers. We have seen so many movies about heroes. The world is clearly interested in this theme and artistic style. We all know how large the movie industry is and what influence it commands on the world. But what if I were to tell you there is an entertainment industry larger than the movies and music industries combined? Is there such a thing? There is. It's called the games industry. What? A recent report has revealed that over 3 billion people play video games. You have no idea what 3 billion people looks like, do you? Well, neither do I. Let's just say this, four in every 10 human beings play video games. Just for comparison, there are 2.3 billion Christians in the world. Yes, there are more gamers than people following Jesus in the world. Before ascending to heaven, Jesus gave us a mission. Go into all the world and preach the good news to everyone. I am sure that everyone also includes gamers. Here is how the Apostle Paul would put it. I have become all things to all people, so that by all possible means I might save some. I do all this for the sake of the gospel, that I may share in its blessings. Think about what great opportunity we have to talk about the greatest hero of all time in the language that gamers would engage with and understand. Of course, we know that there are many Christians that like to play games too. That's how the first Adventist game was born, Heroes the Game, many years ago. Heroes was a great success. It had more than 10 million minutes played across the globe in eight different languages. Heroes was a pioneer game that opened the doors to many other Adventist games. We are now more connected than ever. Three years ago, many Adventist ministries commissioned a study on the most searched for terms on Google in relationship to the Bible. We realized that there are over 250,000 Google searches around the world for Bible trivia, Bible game, and Bible quiz every 30 days. That's right, a quarter of a million people around the world in English are searching for every 30 days for Bible game, Bible trivia, or Bible quiz. Of all the game genres, people are searching for Bible trivia more than any other. So the question came, what if we could take heroes to the next level? What if we could publish the absolute best Bible trivia game ever? We would then be able to help every player to further understand the Bible, to find freedom, healing, and hope in Jesus. Let's do it, we said. Little did we know just how difficult this would be. For the last few years, we have been working with an international team to create Heroes 2, an entirely new Bible trivia game you are going to love. You start with Adam and Eve, the first heroes of the Bible. As they ask you questions about their life, you start accumulating experience points. We call it XP. The more XP you have, the more heroes are unlocked. Noah, Joseph, Moses, Jesus, Mary and John are just some of the 12 heroes waiting to challenge you. You start with Genesis and you end up in Revelation. Each game consists of 12 questions and your score is how quickly you can answer them. That's it, simple, right? Well, at first the questions are easy. For example, Eve could ask you, what was the name of the garden we lived in? Now, even you know the answer to that question, yeah? <laughs> but then the questions get much harder. In fact, we labeled the last question as absolutely impossible questions. So let's see how you fare with those as well. 
But what if you cannot remember the stories? Well, that's when your satchel comes in. You know, a satchel, like a bag that you wear, a satchel. Before starting a game, you can take up to three effects in your satchel. So as you go on your journey, you can take three effects. Now, effects are power-ups that help you on your journey. The Daniel effect, for example, reveals the Bible verse where the correct answer is found. The Joshua effect will freeze time for five seconds just as the sun stopped for Joshua back in the Bible. The Jonah effect will skip the questions just as Jonah skipped the mission. The Lazarus effect will give you a second chance. So when you choose the wrong question, you're back. You get a second chance. Do you get it? It's like Lazarus. Yeah, you get it. But my favorite effect is the Jesus effect because it takes away your wrongs and it shows you the way, pointing to the correct answer. Oh, and I almost forgot. To buy and upgrade your effects, you will need mana. Remember mana in the Bible? Well, how do you get mana? You collect it by knowing the Bible stories and answering the questions correctly. There is even a Friday effect that doubles how much mana you get per question. Isn't this great? I think it's great. Well, Back in 2013, when we released Heroes for the first time, most teenagers were able to win when they played against their parents and even their pastors. Some children were even better than the team that wrote the questions. But that only happened on special events in local churches and maybe some camperies. With Heroes 2, you will be able to challenge someone through a simple email or even a WhatsApp message. This is a new multiplayer mode we have designed just for you. This link would challenge anyone else to play the same exact 12 questions you've just played. The link will be active for 24 hours and there are no limits on how many people can accept your challenge. Heroes 2 will keep a ranking screen for your game so you can find out who is the best at answering Bible questions. Heroes 2 will be available at first in four languages, English, Portuguese, Spanish, and French. But we already have a team working on translating the game for another six languages, for a total of 10 languages very, very soon. All of this is a lot of fun, but our favorite feature is what happens next. Every player will be encouraged to start Bible studies. We call it the big questions. In this special Bible study series, that can be found at hopebiblestudy.org, our heroes are ready to answer what happens when you die. Is God real? If God is good, why do we suffer? And so many other tough questions that we have found from Google search engine optimization research. We basically found what are the top questions people are asking, and we're gonna put that within the heroes Bible studies. That's why we call it the big questions. We will constantly publish new questions as we encourage every player to understand the Bible for themselves. And if they are going through a tough time in their lives, we already have a 24-hour team in place to pray for them and to provide pastoral care. When people who are reading local newspapers and pamphlets, we build publishing houses to proclaim the Three Angels' messages. When people were listening to the radio, we established radio stations that would proclaim the Three Angels' messages. When people were watching television, we started TV channels that would proclaim the Three Angels' messages. When people were using the internet, we started digital ministries that would proclaim the Three Angels' messages. And now, when people are playing games, well, we are developing games to proclaim the Three Angels' messages. The same messages, new technology. I have become all things to all people, so that by all possible means, I might save some. I do all this for the sake of the gospel, that I might share in its blessings. Heroes 2, the Bible trivia game, will help children, youth, and adults alike to get to know more about the amazing stories of the Bible, to realize that you and I are also called to be heroes today, just like these characters from the past. And when all is said and done, we want to inspire every player to give their lives to Jesus so one day they can meet Him, the ultimate hero of all, face to face. It's time to play. You will receive an email in a few minutes with instructions on how to join the beta program so that you can be one of the first people to play the game. Tomorrow we will be live right here on GAIN to be challenging you right here, live. So download the game and start practicing today. So tomorrow when you get the challenge link, you will do well too.